Hello YouTube, I'm back to do another video. I do these so I can learn. I like to be able to talk to others and see how I can improve on my setup. And if somebody can learn something from me along the way, so much the better. Today I want to talk about my cook kit. This is what I used to have. It's an old aluminum cook kit. I've had this for 20 years. I've lost about three of those over the years, but I've upgraded and went to the Coleman Max. Four pot, don't have to worry about losing my handles. My coffee cup, I put a hot lips on it because it tends to burn your lips when you've got hot coffee in here. I like this because I tend to not always use freeze dried or MREs. I make my own MREs or I'll red beans and rice and spam to cook out on. But inside here I've got my cleaning pad, clean up afterwards, coffee and Kool Aid to give me some flavor, salt and pepper. Trucks and taps, my lighter, and this is something that's by Light My Fire. Came in a battle box. It's a little spice thing. I've got three different types of spices in here that I use, flavor my food. A simple old spoon and fork setup that you can get for a buck. Now for what I do for fire, I like my S-Fit stove. I know a lot of people use the compressed gas with the burner. I don't like those. Uh, you run out, what do you got? With this s stove, I can always burn twigs if I run out of fuel. I tend to end up, I'm liking these little fuel tabs that come with us but so it's more and more than I do the trioxane. And from my understanding the military's gotten away from trioxane so the supply may end up drying up. And I'm getting a pack of these, be two of these, for the same price, actually the less, a dollar ninety nine, when a little three tab box of fuel tabs of trioxane tabs runs almost two fifty now. Like I said, if you guys have any advice, any recommendations, I'd be glad to hear them. I'd love to hear from you. Thank you.